Hello and um, welcome to this PHP tutorial that I'll be making called, um, well, that's going to tell you a lot about if else statements if you don't understand them yet. So basically, I've just made a page called page.php, you know, very original. And um, I'm going to start with an opening tag. This is just, you know, I'm sure you pretty much know what the opening tag is. Um, then we're going to start with an if else statement. So basically, there's three or more components, but three basic components to an if else statement. There's the if statement, the else if statement, and the else statement. Now, the if statement can just stand alone. There can just be an if statement. And how you shape an if statement is you say if condition, you know, which we'll put in later. You know, obviously there's no condition right now, so we're just going to italicize that. Well, okay, never mind. Oh, oh great. All right, starting over. So if condition, so um, then if this condition is true, then it will execute a line of statements here. So for example, let's say we made a variable called um, number, and then we set that variable to two. So if our, con our condition would be if number equals equals two, so if number is equal to two, then we'll say um, echo uh, the number is 2. Okay, but since, let's say we had a line of statements like echo numbers 2 and we have, a, you know, um, print or echo, same thing. Um, this is my lucky number. So, okay, we have 2. So, Let's say we have two line of state two statements here, the first echo and the second one, separated by a semicolon. Then we will put them in these braces. But let's say we just had one statement, then we don't need braces and we just leave it like this. But you need this semicolon. All right. So if number is equal to two, echo the number is two, and then we're going to close this. So this is just an if statement with no else and no else if. But if we went to the page. So I have it on localhost here, page.php. It has an output of the numbers too, because this is very true, because the number is two and the number is equal to two, same thing. So that is why it echoes this. But let's say we set the number to three, and then we check the page. It will not output anything, because the number is not equal to two. It is equal to three. All right, so if this is confusing, I'm really sorry. So what an else statement does, we'll skip over else if, and we'll go straight to else. Else is just the opposite of if. So let's say if number is equal to 2, echo this. Else would be the number is not equal to 2, which would be 3. It could be 4, 5, 6, you know, all the numbers. Uh, so else echo the number is not 2. And it, the same thing, if you have two, two statements, then you will need braces. But if you only have one, then you do not need braces. So let's go check um, this again. See, the number is not two because the number is three. All right. Now let's try else if. Else if is basically like an if again. But it's like an if statement, but it's after the if statement. So basically, PHP reads from top to bottom. If we say if number equals 2 and the number is 2, then it will um, output the number is 2, right? So then let's say if the num else if the number is 3, which is correct, as you can see here. If the number is 3, echo the number is 3. So let's try that. And the same braces uh, rule applies to that as well. Oh, look, the output is number is 3 because the n our number variable is outputted to 3. So, okay, let's say we put it to 5. Then the number is neither 2 or 3, so it will go, it will result in the else statement. So let's check. And we'll say the number is not 2 or 3, you know, because it isn't. So let's save that, and then we'll check it out. The number is not 2 or 3. You can have, here, if we go back, you can have as many else if statements as you like. Um, but you can only have one if statement and only one else statement. And the else if statement is um, 
very it's optional as is the else statement but um you know so it's fun to have extra but you know I don't know that's just me okay so I hope this has made um, some sense if not I'm very sorry uh, this is basically your if else statements and I hope this helps and this has been another PHP tutorial by blue skies 94 thank you so much